Greetings to you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Welcome as we share from the book of Romans chapter 4. Today we look at verse number 17 and 18. The Bible says, As it is written, I have made you a father of many nations. He is our father in the sight of God, in whom he believed, the God who gives life to the dead and calls into being things that were not. Against all hope, Abraham in hope believed and so became the father of many nations, just as it had been said to him, so shall your offspring be, praise the name of the Lord. We started by saying that this is about the promises of God and also with a focus on Abraham's faith. God promised Abraham and here again, his faith is mentioned. He believed in God. And this is God who is well described in verse number 17, that he is, our, he is God, the God who gives life to the dead. And secondly, God who calls things into being, things that were not. So he's such a mighty God. Abraham believed in this powerful and mighty God. Verse 15, against all hope, he, this is Abraham, Abraham had hope and believe in God. Against all hope. The situation at hand, when analyzed and assessed, there is a possibility of saying, there is no hope in this. And no wonder in verse number 17, we are told that this is God who gives life to the dead. In total hopelessness, believing and hoping in God gives us a breakthrough. And because God keeps his word, he is always ready to stand with his own. Key thing here, put your faith and trust in God, hope in the Lord. The Bible says against all hope, Abraham in hope believed. Against all hope, Abraham in hope believed. And so it, he became the father of many, the father of many nations, just as it had been said to him. When we choose to hope against hope. And in hope, we believe in God. The Lord is always together with us to fulfill that promise. He gave you, he gave me. Ours is to believe and to hope in the Lord. But when we lose hope, even what was said to us and about us will not happen. Listen to this. Against our hope, Abraham in hope believed and so became the father of many nations, just as it had been said to him. The issue you are handling, the matter that looks hopeless in your life, remember, there is what God has said about it. Your hope and trust in the Lord, hoping against hope, will enable you to wait for tomorrow and what was said to you will surely come to pass. For Abraham, what was said is that so shall your offspring be. You will become uh, the father of many nations and because of hoping in God and believing in God, he was made so. And above all, apart from the just the open word about the nations is told, so shall your offspring be. Brothers and sisters, the Lord is calling us to hope against hope. Sometimes when you look at the situation at hand, you feel like you have all the reasons to say it is not possible. Hope against hope and believe in God. And whatever he has said about you, about that situation, 
you surely come to be. God bless you. God keep you. Have a lovely time. Shalom.